It's amazing that something just like beef could be so life-changing. But like you said, this is a spiritual war. I've heard that they're even in certain products, they're casting spells on certain meats. Oh, another, another goosebump. We have to be very discerning about the foods that we put into our body, how we fuel our body, because you're right, this is a spiritual war, a war of good versus evil. And we've got to right. be healthy and strong so that when God calls upon us, we're like, yes, God, put me in. I'm ready to go into the game. So right. what, Trisha, what made you want to get involved in this? Well, I started to realize, like for myself, Shemaine, I started to ask myself some questions like, am I walking the walk? Am I, am I like, where am I throwing my money? Like stop funding the big box stores, support USA, align yourself with conservative values. Like it's one thing to talk about it, but are you really doing it? Like be conscious of your choices. Cause look, let's think about it. A little bit of poison here, a little bit of poison there, a little bit of poison on my skin. A little, let me just, oh, let me try that lab grown meat, which I would never. But all these little poisons add up, and then what do you have? You have some like horrible disease, but even more so right now, spiritual warfare. I mean, it, it doesn't get any worse, I think, than it, than it is right now.